Good evening. How's everyone doing this evening? Good, good. We're glad you're here. Uh, my name is Tony Hawkins, and I'm the Dean of Arts, Humanities, and Social Sciences here at the Tacoma Park Silver Spring Campus of Montgomery College. And it is indeed my honor to welcome you to the 2013 ALTA Awards. Um, on behalf of Montgomery College's president, Dr. Deerium Pollard, as well as our vice president and provost, welcome. Uh, this is our third year serving as the location host for the awards. Um, and we're honored again to present this celebration of outstanding stewards of living traditions in the state of Maryland and its three honorees this evening, Blacksmith Wally Yader, Piscataway Homelands People, Culture, and Traditions, and the Oyster Fritters of the Sharptown Firemen's Carnival. Um, we know here at Montgomery College that we are represented by students from over 170 countries throughout the world. Uh, we can give you demographics about our student population, about our faculty, staff, and administrators. Um, it's really nice to have this event here at the college because it gives us an opportunity to see the rich diversity of our, of our state. Um, and being able to work in, in partnership uh, with the Maryland State Arts Council and the Maryland Traditions Program to celebrate the diversity within the state of Maryland is indeed our pleasure. If you would, um, I'd like to uh, ask you to pick up a copy of our uh, spring brochure for the Cultural Arts Center. Um, it will present uh, to you a variety of offerings in both the arts and humanities that we offer here in the, in the Cultural Arts Center. Um, as well as our sister building across the street, the Kayfords Foundation Arts Building. Um, they have a beautiful series of galleries there, um, and the two buildings complement each other uh, as a presentation of the arts um, and humanities here within the county. Um, currently, um, the, there's an exhibit of our fine faculty in the visual arts and design department over in the King Street Gallery, so I please uh, encourage you to go and check it out. Um, I'm asked to give you a reminder of cell phones. Um, we're in a digital world now, so we really are tied to our cell phones, but if you could, could you put them on mute? Um, if you have the need to text or to look something up, uh, just be aware that sometimes this could be a little distracting for your neighbors. Um, as well as taking photographs, just remember that there are people probably standing behind you um, that don't mind you taking a picture, but if you could sit down really quickly or get your arms down really quickly, they would appreciate it. Um, it's at this point that I'm, uh, once again, thank you, thanking you for making it here uh, to Montgomery College, to the Tacoma Park Silver Spring Campus, um, and uh, looking forward to the awards ceremony and the concert. Thank you, and have a wonderful evening.
Thank you so much for being here at the, at the Maryland Traditions Alta Awards Ceremony and Concert. My name is Cliff Murphy. I'm the director of Maryland Traditions. It's really a pleasure to be here and to see all of you here. Um, I, you'll be hearing more from me soon, but uh, here to introduce the Sweet Heaven Kings and to tell you a little bit about them uh, is Julia Olin, one of our partners from the National Council for the Traditional Arts. So please, Le Julia Olin. The Sweet Heaven Kings are carrying on a glorious tradition that began actually in uh, 1919 with the founding of, of the United House of Prayer for All People. It was founded by Charles M. Sweet Daddy Grace in West where, um, uh, Massachusetts and quickly spread uh, throughout the Mid-Atlantic and Southeast. Today, there are 145 congregations in 29 states. Uh, Washington, D.C. has a, a been a center of church activity for a very long time. The church headquarters, called God's White House, was moved to Washington, D.C. in 1927. And uh, by the 1960s, the trombone-led gospel choir of brass that is so distinctive and unique to the United House of Prayer had emerged as the signature sound of church services. Uh, the, we have two folks here, uh, the leader of the group, Norvis Miller Sr. of Capitol Heights, Maryland, <laughs> and his son, Norvis Miller Jr., Little Butch, is here. They, uh, Little Butch is actually represents the third generation of, uh, of musicians in the Miller family. Uh, their father was the longtime leader of the Kings of Harmony, the uh, shout band uh, for the God's Own White House. So, and the two of them uh, were awarded a Maryland Traditions Apprenticeship Award in 2011. And they're here with us tonight with all of the outstanding members of one of the very finest shout bands in the nation, the Sweet Heaven Kings. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. There you go. Now, as you know, we are a church band. And the church we come from, we get loose. <laughs> Is that all right? Yeah, we get loose. So we don't want y'all to sit too quiet. We want to have a good time. Is that OK? So I want you to put your hands together and clap your hands. And if you know the songs that we're playing, Sing along with us. The first song we're going to do is Precious Lord, Take My Hand. Anybody know that? Well, we're going to do it our way. Is that all right? All right, so I want you, you can stand on your feet and pat your hand and pat your foot. Is that all right? Put your hands together like this.
We're not playing too loud, though. No. You sure? Yes, Good, we're going to play a little loud. <laughs> Somebody say, crank it up. We're going to crank it up a little bit. We're going to do a little song. Just a little bit of it. We only, we only have a few minutes. But we're just going to touch it a little bit. Is that all right? It's called rain on us. Is that all right? Let the spirit rain on us. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's good to be alive, doesn't it? 